What's up, it's Terry B. Coming to you with another riding video. I'm gonna have to get by a bus right here. I uh, just wanna give you a quick look at what the camera setup looks like while I'm on my bike. You can see my bars from my POV, which is a simple chesty setup with a gimbal and a GoPro. And that's my audio with a lab mic into here. Simple. So I am riding, it's kind of windy today. You may or may not be able to hear. But last time I did one of these videos with this bike, um, well, the first time I did it earlier last week, I was riding to uh, go drop off some tires so I can get my gravel bike ready. Well, got a phone call the other day that I missed and my voice message just said, hey, Terry, your wheels are done. So I'm headed on over to uh, Sun and Air now to go pick up those new wheels. Well, old wheels, new tires. They're set up tubeless and kind of excited to ride it. Maybe I'll give it a little pedal today. We'll see. A little test ride. Maybe I'll do some, a uh, couple road laps at Prospect or something to see if everything's rolling right before I take it on a real ride. I would ride the trails at Prospect, but uh, it has rained the last day and a half or two days. So. so right now we're rolling through Brooklyn. This is Bed-Stuy. Brownstones to the right and left. Still lots of Christmas decorations up. I like this area a lot. I love the uh, architecture, the houses in this area. Whew, it is cold and windy today. I got a backpack. Um, on with like a windbreaker rain jacket. I'm definitely gonna put that on once I get over to Sun and Air. So I really it said it was 40 degrees out, but with the wind, it feels more like 30. <laughs> my ears are freezing, my nose is running. So this road here is called Throop. It goes from uh, Fulton all the way like to Flushing, I believe, with the bike lane. It's kind of the like chill bike lane route to get from Bedside to like. Williamsburg Bridge, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Oh, okay, wind today. Whew. I'm getting blown all over the place, blown right through these red lights. I try to stop, but the wind's blowing me, you know? See, I just got gusted through that red light. Crazy. The food guy stopped. Chasing food people. Should we start the video here? <laughs> I 
We got a little tire flat fix here on the road. Typical New York thing. Just do a servicing your fat flat fixes on the uh, middle of the roads here. Man, you guys see dude's chain, the food delivery guy's chain? You can tell he never pedals that bike. Thing is rusted out. Rusty. Guy needs some fucking lube, man. These bikes right here are everywhere. He's gonna pass me, watch. This thing, the thing they got like 25, 30. You can push the throttle all the way down. And you see him riding around, and I don't know if you saw him there, but they always hang a foot. It's like their thing. It's like every single food person with one of those like Chinese e-bikes, the big battery, they all fucking hang a foot. And in the summer, in the summer they're wearing like flip-flops or sandals. And they're hanging their they're hanging their foot and their sandals like falling off. It's it's pretty funny. It's like I don't know if it's intentional or not, but I notice it. It's like their call sign or something. So we're rolling up here on the end of the uh, the bike lane. Um, fun fact: last time I rode my gravel bike. I had some road tires set up tubeless and I have like one of the leaderboard KLMs on this street and I was, you know, it was early morning so there's no one out so I was smashing, smashing down through because so I was like, yeah, I'm going to break it, break the time or whatever. My record, I got right here and the tire fucking blew off tubeless tire blew off and I went sliding somehow didn't crash I was on carbon rims so I couldn't like break really fast and hard on the because the rear one blew off thank god it was in the front it was like ice like trying to stop on ice it was so fucked because that rim I damaged it a little bit it was kind of like sliding <laughs> like plastic on asphalt you know it was terrifying. Um, and I ended up trying to fix the flat and then I was like, you know what, fuck this. I ended up uh, just grabbing my track bike and uh, catching everyone later. They all, we all did a, a ride up to uh, River Road. Anyways, this uh, structure here to the right is the uh, J, M, and Z trains run above Broadway here. It's uh, a very Brooklyn, New York looking thing. Also Queens, I guess. I guess parts of Harlem too. I don't know this. I always think Brooklyn when I see it. Um, you seen that video where Cyclist steals my selfie stick. It was me and Safa. I'll link it in the video here. Check it out. But we filmed from the top of uh, Broadway tracks all the way back to the bottom where it ends over there. And uh, the premise of the video is I'm riding, like vlogging or something on my bike and some cyclist comes up behind me and steals my camera. That cyclist was Safa and I chase him. Kind of fun. I'm gonna go through this light. It was too windy, it just pushed me through again. Crazy. Maybe I'll end up on uh, bad cycling once again. Who knows? Who's this guy riding a track bike? He's got the SF wide bars with the, the MASH Chinelli. Ch 
Marcinelli mash, Marcinelli. The old gray and blue one. It's mad windy, son. I always take this little road over to uh, the bridge from my place because South Forth, it's mellow. Usually not a lot of cars. There's a little roadway here. Look at this, we got Brian and Becca. Brian and Becca, say hi to YouTube. <laughs> Brian, Chu, and Becca. They got a truck. They live right over here in this building somewhere. That's cool to see them. All right, what's this guy doing? This is the BQE to the Williams, I mean to the Williamsburg Bridge from the BQE above me, on and off it. And we're in Williamsburg. Well, we've been in Williamsburg, but this is like the front of the bridge here. Hey, bud. See? That guy didn't even see me. <laughs> That's my problem. I don't care if people break the rules. I do it all the time. Just pay attention to your surroundings when you do it. I guess it happens sometimes. Skirt. Wow, look at that thing. Is that yours? Yeah. Wow. How many miles does the thing go before uh, you have to charge? 48, I think. 48, really? How fast does it go, do you know? 45. <laughs> that ain't a bike. Yeah. That's like a motorcycle. Yeah, That's cool. <laughs> have you taken it out of the city? Uh, no, not yet. I just got it like a week ago. Oh, cool. Yeah. But it can go on the sand. Like yeah. Those tires, you can do anything. You don't wear a helmet? I, I need to get a <laughs> I'm not going to go really off. Of, oh, yeah. I need to get a, yeah, that little cable lock ain't going to no, do nothing. nothing. Yeah. We're trying to find a good store, though. But They're probably going to tell you to go to King Cog. King Cog? <laughs> you need a chain lock, probably. Yeah. yeah. It folds, too? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Did you buy that in New York, or was it online? No, it, it's online. I waited, cool. like, six months for it. Cool. Yeah. yeah. Did you ride bikes before this? No, not really. That's cool. It's getting yeah. you into riding. That's cool. Exactly. Have a good day. You too.